guys, Dan Chaos here, coming at you with a brand new video. This time, we are coming at you with another anime deck challenge for 2020. This time, we are doing Bonda Fontaine from the anime. Now, uh, I don't remember much from her. Uh, I know she did play Nurse Refutool and a uh, small Dark Ward deck. Um, so, we're going to start off with the anime deck profile, which is where we are now. Then, we're going to go to my updated version of the deck, and then on to replays that showcase how the deck does. So, to start off, we... <laughs> she ran, in the anime, one Guardian Angel Jill, two Dark Lord Mary, three Dark Lord Nerf Revicule, two Hysteric Fairy, one Mecha Dog Marin, one Spirit of the Breeze, three Fire Princess, one Witch of the Black Forest, Triple Injection Fairy Lily, and two bring algae for monsters. Then for spells, one foolish burial, two messenger of peace, two reign of mercy, one dying keto, one upstart, one gravity bind, one late of the uh, sorry, give me a second intervention, and three bad reactions of Simochi, three dark cure, three gift card, and three solemn wishes. So. She has a solidly decent deck. Um, this picture is brought to you guys from our good friends over at Anime uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! Deck Recipes over on Twitter and on Instagram. Make sure to drop them a follow. Alright, so on to my version of the deck. See you guys over there. Hey, what's up guys? Here we are my version of the Anime Fond the Fontaine Nurse Burn deck. Uh, we're going to start off with the deck profile and I'm going to get right into the replays. So to start off, we run three Dark War Ditchel, one Imbus, one Mary, three Nurse Dark Tool, three Condemned Witch, then three Lord Darkness, one Dark Lord Contact, one Upstart Goblin, three Banished from the Dark Lords, two Pog Duality, one Forbidden Chalice, one Contact of 1000, then after we run two Secret Barrel, three Gift Card, three Passive Destiny, three Triumph Guess, two Ring of Destruction, along with one Dark Lord Enchantment, and three battery action smoky. And the extra deck I run a well, small nightmare package of Cerberus, Phoenix, and Unicorn, along with two Condemned Dark Lord, one Unchained Combination, one Boros Lord Dragon, and for our rank fours we run one number sixty, one Abyss Dweller, one Fairy Sure Girl, just to draw cards, one Baguska, one Tornado Dragon, and a small utility package. So, generally, this deck just wants to set up Nurse Rapitule and then give your opponent a whole bunch of life points, which in turn ends up burning them because of Nurse Rapitule's effect. Um, this deck can sneak wins, or you can just die doing 5,000 points of damage and be very sad. Um, the deck's not really meta. Uh, there's also another card. Um, Condemned Witch is actually a really interesting card for this deck because uh, when she's normal summoned, she can search a forbidden card, a forbidden quick play spell card from your deck, um, which is something like Forbidden Chalice or a new card called Forbidden Droplets, which is a very solid tech card to run in this deck instead. Uh, it pretty much turns into an impermanence on your opponent's turn due to her ability to, uh, well, sorry, once you set it and activate it, you can discard any number of cards from your hand target that same amount of monsters, and for each type of card you discarded, um, Forbidden Droplets make, uh, makes it this way you cannot, your opponent cannot respond to uh, Forbidden Droplets activated. Uh, so besides that tangent, uh, we run one contract with Don Um which is just a lovely card. Uh, so interesting fact, if you activate Contract and you reveal an opponent's danger, as long as that danger is revealed, they cannot Special Summon or activate that danger effect, because it's revealed. Then, Secret Barrel is just to do some minor damage to your opponent, um, Paths of Destiny, Gift Card, and Try and Guess are the same kind of uh, card just to use to deal damage to your opponent and try to get the FTK if possible. Uh, Ring of Destruction just helps in the long game to just 
you know, strip your opponent of a couple resources and then deal damage as well. Um, Samochi is just another uh, card, just way if they do out the Reficule, you can still burn them off of your gift cards and your, you know, win cons. But, um, other than that, the deck's okay. Uh, I kind of had a lot of fun playing with it. Um, we do have three wins. And, uh, yeah. Alright, off the replays we go. Alright guys, here we are at the Atomacia replay. Okay, our first one. So, let's start it. Apparently the opponent did not see much uh, in the ways of good cards. So, we started off with activating Condemned Witch, Normal Summoning Her Effect, and then activating Forbidden Drop, just to get Forbidden Droplets. But, sadly, because uh, he had his Emancipator card, he could tribute his monster and remove our Forbidden Droplets from the field before we could do anything. Alright, so on to his turn. Uh, I choose to swap out the Reficule, and then on his effect, we will choose Synchro to give him damage. And then we will also bring up Destruction and get rid of his Animashmia. Animashmia tuner before he can go off and start making more plays. Then we just do a little spot damage, and we have game due to gift card. And that's it. Alright guys, off to the second replay. Alright guys, so here we are, second replay. So we played a different iteration of the deck and uh, had to blind the lore with seeing no dark monster. Apparently we're playing against Cyaframe Mech Knights and uh, we're just going to ring your destruction to do some plot damage. And uh, trap trick for try and guess. And a top deck of desires. So. This variant of the deck was uh, another variant that I was trying with uh, multiple variants with uh, yeah, multiple copies of a lovely card called uh, <laughs> Forbidden Droplets. But sadly, running too many versions of Forbidden Droplets can kind of hurt you. And uh, if you don't really see your nurse, you kind of can see wrong nurse. But Forbidden Droplets comes to save our butts for the turn. Top deck emoji and end our turn. I think this might be the loss. Yes, it's right. All right, so we did have one loss in here. Um, so yeah, <laughs> that hand we didn't really see any of our monsters to make any, you know, at least set up a defensive wall to help your opponent. Um, the allure would just kind of sucked. So on to the third and final replay, and then we'll hit the end card. Alright. Alright guys, here's the last replay against Salad. So we start off excuse my dog. We start off with Desires and Get Ash. And then we just, you know, go through some Dark Lord plays, give him the Mary, and uh it shall get more plays, and then we sit and end our turn. So we're gonna activate that to deal ourselves and the opponent something under each. Because I was going to activate, I'm going to forbid droplets it. Then I will trap trick for Path of Destiny. And I will take Tails, and he will also get Tails. And we will take a ton of damage, and he will get rid of it off of his called by. And, there, and uh, one thing about Nurse Mary, and yeah. Another blind lore leads to nothing. Yeah, apparently we also had two losses, so. Dying slowly to salad. Alright, guys. Um, thanks for tuning in. Uh, we're going to go off to the end card, and uh, hope you enjoy the replays. Here we go. Alright, guys, so we are at the end of the video. Thank you very much for tuning in. Don't forget to leave a like on the video. Don't forget to comment your suggestions for our next anime deck replay or anime deck challenge. And uh, don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Also, drop a sub to all of our friends in the description. 
thanks for tuning in, and uh, we'll catch you later. Don't forget, be a scrub. <laughs>